Hello, everybody on the internet listening to this right now in their ear holes. This is Blank Block, a podcast, a podcast from 320 somethings who have all fallen into the void and cannot get back up or pronounce words. Uh, join with me today is Ashley Maligan. Hey, oh, it's me. And Serafina Buick. Oi, 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 oi. We are football fans. Oh, also, I'm Cameron Bloomer. Um, <laughs> we are football fans today because we all love sport. Isn't that yeah. right? Yeah, yes, cause we, because we like sports. Because last week, what we would have been talking about, but uh-uh. Uh-uh, we talked about Vuvu Zaylas. Uh-uh. So... No, let's not let's not talk about the forbidden episode, mm. the one that through no fault of my own <laughs> I lost. <laughs> Oof. It was an accident. You say that. I think there was malicious. Things intent. didn't save correctly. I think correctly. you need to sue yeah. your uncle. What I actually <laughs> did was I went in and corrupted the audio file just so I didn't have to listen to us make voo voo zayla noises for <laughs> that is three true. hours of my life. We did make a lot of voo voo zayla noises. We did make a lot of voo voo zayla noises. We, At some yeah. point, I will go through both of your audio and whatever <laughs> I can salvage from mine, and I'll do a voo voo zayla supercut. I will say also it's probably a good thing that that episode did get cut because it was um, – we did – start chanting during one point and it, it turned into like um it, it's the podcast version of the ring um so if anybody did hear that they would have had to um share it or else um somebody was going <laughs> to climb out of their phone and kill them um and they would have been phone out their headphones <laughs> yeah they crawl out their headphones into their ear. they're tiny tiny little ring girls that climb into your brain Who's ready to podcast? Tis I. Let's go. Right, bringing the energy back. Oh, yeah, I've got... Uh, okay, cool. I've got a question <laughs> for you guys. <laughs> Have you been, um... Oh, this may say where I'm at. Have you guys been working hard or hardly working? I... Yeah, carry on. I have been doing the complete opposite of working. In fact, I've created negative work for myself. <laughs> by up and losing the audio files. Oof. Um... Yeah, so, yeah, like, so, you know. But what you've been whatever. doing is you've been working and then it just going to shit. So it is, I guess it is negative work where you've been working to achieve nothing. So that's depressing and awful. I'm so sorry. Well, no, it was more like I opened up my laptop, clicked on the audio file to start editing it, and it gave me error messages. A big, and then it just yeah. continued to give me vague error messages that wouldn't make any sense. And then a big middle finger came up and you knew. <laughs> mm. I was I sh- I should have known around the time that it said that it was only like three seconds long as an audio <laughs> clip, and I was like, hmm, I think hmm. we recorded for a bit longer than that. But you're like, it was a Ooh. shorter episode. But... <laughs> this could, oh, this one's going to be an easy one to edit. That's a let you just. Back. <laughs> you're like, oh, thank goodness, only three seconds. <laughs> Four. We're getting better. It's only going to take me about two hours. <laughs> and it's all Boo Boo Zayla sound. <laughs> oh my god three seconds of vuvuzela terrible yeah. and that's all the vuvuzela jokes we're allowed to make this yes, episode yes yes good cool um serafina have you been working hard or hard well working? um i have now been in my new house for a week because last week i had just moved in but now Ooh. it's i've been here for for a week now um yeah, it's very nice. It's very cozy. I've smashed a board in my hallway, so that's really nice. Okay, wait, okay, smashed a board. Um, like a floorboard, or no? It was like I, um, I so. Uh, Did you bring the board into your hallway to smash? <laughs> no, it's there. So basically, it's like a little board from like our um our landlord being like, "Welcome to your new home. Here's like bin dates and stuff." Oh, okay. <laughs> so it's a notice board. <laughs> so it's a notice board, you basically. <laughs> It's the notice board being like, hey, here's um the days for everything. This is when you need to do this. Uh, if you need to do the gas, like, this is the number to call. And you're like, fuck this. You're not going to tell me what to do. <laughs> landlords the gas. are scum. Fuck the gas. I think, I think you should have waited for the landlord to come in and then taken the ball off the wall and snapped it over your knee. <laughs> While staring <laughs> in the eyes, said, "Here's what I think about your rules, well, landlord is, man." The thing is, I'm like, and all my housemates are like, "Oh, oh my god, like, how are we gonna tell like it was like there?" And I was like, "Well, it, we'll just say it's there." But then I'm like, they literally just redone this house and they filled that wall in and put that board there. So like, I can't blame mm-hmm. on the old tenants because I because de- it's impossible that there was a door there before. So Oof. um, 
Um, so they know yeah. it's you. It was the door trying to <laughs> reassert itself. <laughs> so oh no, yeah, yeah, they'd covered up the door, but the door fought back. <laughs> it's like, excuse me, back. I open here. <laughs> I'm not a wall. I'm a door. You're like, when <laughs> God closes one door, he doesn't. He paints <laughs> another. <laughs> That's what when you should God say to him. When God closes one door. It swings the opposite way because it's one of those like um, <laughs> saloon style doors where they just swing backwards and forwards. Oh, I like that. <laughs> when God, God opens one, one door. door. Wait, when God closes one door, Serafina smashes herself into a wall and breaks the board. Uh, oh my God, you were the Kool Aid Man very briefly. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh yeah. Whoops, camera disconnected. <laughs> ah. Ah. I'm back in the call. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> was that was that funny? What happened? You cut out mid sentence, and then me and Serafina just made a series of ah noises until you came back. Okay, you need to cut my um audio in the podcast exactly when it cuts when you in the call because that that would be better for comedy anyway um, I will. i'll put the bit that you actually said in the blooper reel. <laughs> yes thank you so, um yeah so i so cameron have you? you been working hard yeah, i was gonna working? ask you that you dumb dumb yeah but okay you well didn't. don't interrupt the man asking himself a question no i need like, to ask him because so i'm i'm okay. i'm microphone now i'm, ca- I'm hold, giving hey you cameron hey no 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 hey, Seraphine has to ask me cameron what have Fuck you been you. doing <laughs> okay i okay. hey cameron you've been working hard at hollywood oh thank you so much for asking me ashley i love you so Fuck much off. beautiful um i have been um i've been i've been working hard but like maybe not with like the most productive things i've been making a lot of macrame plant hangers um so I love that so much i well, I, I hate say, to ask, yeah. but what the fuck is that? <gasps> so, you don't know. They're so Tumblr and so Instagram and so social media right now. Yeah, they're very, they're very, they're very seventies <laughs> and like seventies to eighties vibes. Uh, when everybody had plants in the house, and now that's coming back. So of course, macrame come with it too. Um, <laughs> so I say macrame in England. I think it's macrame. I don't know. Ew, macrame. Are you are you failing to pronounce the word macaroni? That's what it is. Oh that's, God, I've pasta, been eating a lot of pasta. Ma- I've been making pasta. Um, no, so <laughs> I've been making so much pasta. All week long, all day, every day, just pasta, pasta, pasta. pasta, pasta. pasta. We are getting these carbs, ladies pasta, and gentlemen. Pasta, 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 pasta. pasta, oh, pasta I got bronze in Atlanta. <laughs> <laughs> okay. um, Congratulations! You just got yourself uh, the chance to sell that verse to Kanye West, so we can put it on one of his songs. Um, thank you. I have made, I think, five macrame plant hangers now. Um, they essentially, so you get a bunch of string, you weave it together. It's like a hanging basket, but it looks aesthetic and tumblery. Um, mm. And okay, they have them at Animal been, Crossing, um, I think. Do they? Yeah. Oh hell yeah! Um, so my room's an Animal Crossing house now. Mm. Um, and yeah, it's just been kind of feeding my soul it's like it reminds me of when i used to knit it's just oh it's so i can just like blank out just do nothing just fiddle with my fingers and make a plant (laughs) (laughs) i've reduced myself can you please i really really want one like oh my gosh you're gonna get one honestly because they really are they're like 30 pounds for a piece of rope and i'm like bruh exactly like, and I, I can make them in, like, just over an hour. Mm. So, like, you're getting one, oh, Serafina. You. Actually, you're also getting Cameron. one. I don't care if you want one thank or not. You. Um, I mean, my grandma will probably appreciate it for the house. That's super cute. Um, what I was more thinking is, if these sell for £30 a piece, and you can make them in an hour, why the fuck are you recording this podcast and not just cranking out macaroni? Um, Because, you know, I think it's 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 kind of like a spiritual thing for me, and I don't know if I want to monetize that. <laughs> oh, shut up. Oh, shut up. No, and this J- isn't nah, spiritual JK. for you? And this isn't spiritual for you? No, this no, is like... this is the worst deeply. thing I do every week. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> this is damaging. 
This um, is toxic. Every time we finish recording, I just lie down on the floor and cry. Yeah, hey I guys, scream on a wall. Yeah. I've got big news for you today. Ooh. Huge news. Are you about to tell Massive me? Massive news. No. Pee pee? Massive. Huge news. That's right. We have been dropped by conversationstartersworld.com. <gasps> what? They no longer want us. What? Uh, and by that, I mean we no longer want them. <laughs> we are now using improv.com. Wait. Wait, you can't just... Wait. No, this is... <laughs> I'm going to cry. Uh, what? Question number 117. Stop. On the improv Stop. list. <laughs> wait. Stop. Okay, but you have to... T- t- wait, wait, wait. Why, why aren't we using conversation stars? This is change. I don't like change. Change is scary. What's going on? We have gone through every good question on conversation starters world because it turns Impossible. out that when you have Im- 6,000 questions, only four of them are good. <laughs> um, trust me, I spent oh. at least five minutes looking for conversation starters world.com before I made this decision for us. Guys, this is the end of an era. Can we get a moment of silence for conversation starters.com? <laughs> Best friendship ended with conversationstartersworld.com. Now I am best friends with improv.com. Okay, but like just Rest just like just five seconds of silence, please, starting now. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> <We're> just... <laughs> <laughs> Serafina, did you just burp during the five five second silence? I think I did. I'm sorry. Oh. I, when you gotta go, it's better out than in. I you're always s- say. You're so disrespectful. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna cancel the five second silence. Yeah. Um, no. Conversation I... start as well. Com is dead to me now. I agree. I think Serafina um, put it the best when she burped. <laughs> I hope that website shuts down and never comes back. Improv. Com. Mm-hmm. Question number 117 on, I think the list is called weird or funny questions to ask. Mm. This is number 117 coming straight at you. This is, would you rather sweat melted cheese or have live snakes for hair? Have live snakes for hair. And that means all, no, that's all of your hair. Okay. And you have to feed them like body hair. Oh, so I can't just like cut them off. Head hair. You can, but you would have the dead, decaying stumps of snakes growing out of your body. Mm. Hmm. Huh. I think I'd still huh. have the snakes, honestly. Also, they eat and probably shit. Okay. I think I'm, I'd still I'm, have the snakes. Nah, I'm a sweat. I mean, I'm a sweat cheese. I hate that so much. I'm, I'm really glad cheese. that one of us I decided could, that they would sweat cheese. I think cheese. I could. No, I could deal with snakes on my head like very well, but like. Snake, You've got really hairy snakes. legs. Exactly. So, snakes yeah. on my legs. I don't know if I could deal with. Is that thousands of snakes in your trousers? Or are you just happy to see that? <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> that is very... You're like, yeah, it is. <laughs> I'm a sweaty bitch. Gas. That's true. Ashley, you sweat a hell of a lot. If I were to suddenly turn that into liquid cheese, there would be a very big problem for the cheese markets. Mm. Because... I, like I'm currently sat in a very cold room and I'm sweating. Oof. Um, I should probably stop recording this at the walk-in freezer at Tesco, but you know. <laughs> that's kind of your like best climate. Yeah, that's where I live. Honestly, I think you were made to live in the Antarctic. <gasps> I think I was, and I think I'd just be walking around in the shorts and t-shirt, and I'd still be like, "Oh, a bit hot today, isn't it? A bit oh, sweaty. A bit nippy. Yeah, a bit sweaty." Am I not nippy? Wrong yeah, way. Like, Wrong. I'd, I'd be wearing big, thick gloves and big, thick boots, and the rest of me would just be like shorts, t shirt. Yeah, protect the essentials. Yeah. Um, I would not be wearing a thermal cup because frostbite to the genitals is not the worst way for them to go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they'll just fall off and they. It, and you wouldn't feel it. Yeah. Yeah, one day I'd like sneeze and I'd just feel something shake down my trousers. You would. Like, oh, it would no. be when you sneezed, knowing you. Well, yeah, I do have that perennium pain when mm. I sneeze sometimes. So, okay, but, like, if you are in the Antarctic, would you have frozen cheese coming out of you? Or would you just not? Well, does the sweat freeze before it exits your body? That's my question. I guess Because I know that in very hot climates, it can evaporate before it leaves your skin. Oh. And it leaves just the salt crystals. Oh. Yeah. Um, and then when you rub your skin, it, like, smushes salt crystals all across your head and, like, cuts you, like, on a subdermal level. Yeah. Oh. I love yeah. something today. Um, it's called prickly heat. And <laughs> if you're a sweaty bitch like me, you better be avoiding 35 degrees and above. Although, here's the thing. If you then sweat cheese, you just like, you turn into a grilled cheese. 
I would it would also very much smell terrible. Yeah. I feel like that's I'd have yeah. I'd have to sleep on like suspended from ropes above like a pig pen. <laughs> so that all of the cheese would just fall in and they could eat it. That is true. You could be like to be honest, you could you could feed people, you know? Mm. I don't think anybody oh, wants to eat my come, rancid come body the, cheese, though. Come to the cheese fondue, <laughs> but it's just us you suspended from the sky. <laughs> we've, we've, we've put buck <laughs> naked with a, with a heater on top of me. Oh, my yeah. gosh. Get a little marshmallows. Everybody gather around the like... Ashley. I don't know. What do you think? I'm still trying to be involved in the party, though, so I'm just yelling from up there, like, hey, good party, huh? You had some of the cheese? And everyone's like, shut up, cheese girl! <laughs> shut up! I... I'm more than just the cheese that extrudes from my Shut pores. Shut up, cheese girl. Shut up. <laughs> I don't want this. Shut up, cheese girl. Daddy cheese girl. Daddy cheese girl. I honestly think that in either of these situations, I would probably be inclined to, um, uh-oh, whoopsie myself off of a cliff. Yeah. But, you know, I think the snakes for hair thing. It's aesthetic. Eventually, mm. you're gonna be become friends with your snakes. Yeah, yeah. <gasps> you know, I can be like, like learning to love uh, and care for like, yourself. Like the, they're from Monsters Inc. They have little cones around their heads. I can put little cones around their heads so they can be like Mike Wazowski, and then I can um, eat sushi, and I'm, I'm living Monsters Inc. girl life. Yeah, and I can gouge out one of my eyes, and then we can date Seraphina. <laughs> I would. Enjoy it if we'd stop infringing on Disney's copyrighted material now. That's very okay. true. Because we are but a simple, yeah. humble country bumpkins. Yeah. And Disney literally is more powerful than God. <laughs> um, uh. So, again, if it was just snakes on my head, that's fine. But gooch snakes, I cannot deal with. You get gooch hair? Gooch. Moving on. I know, I am Wait, I am what's gooch? What's gooch? That I do not... Is it your coochie? I do not know what a coochie is. Coo- is it coochie? No. It's, it's, the, it's the sweet, sweet taint. It's the bit of skin in between the end of the nutsack and the beginning of the asshole. Oh, I didn't, I didn't never knew that what that was. It's the gooch. It's the taint, the perennial. I've heard the Wait, does word that mean every time I've asked you? Does that mean every time I've asked you the question of whether or not when you sneeze, sometimes your taint hurts? You've just been like, I don't know what you mean. But then you just said no anyway. No. I'm divorcing. Wow. <laughs> so you Wait. were just you were just the whole time you were just like, yeah, sure. I thought no, yeah, I know what you mean. I thought taint yeah, what? Taint taint in the um uh, bum hole to v- vagina. V- uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, okay. okay, you do know what a taint is. But then what yeah, but I've never heard the word gooch before. And yeah, people I get think... hair there. People get hair everywhere. Yeah, thank you, Serafina. I'm incredibly lucky. I do not have gooch hair. And well, you have facial hair. Anyway. I'm annoyed. I've got the worst um, end of well, the deal. <laughs> to be quite honest with you, I think me having facial hair as a trans woman oh. is perhaps not the best vibe. That's very true. I would like to posit that. I would like, like I would like to it To be on quite me. honest with you, if I could migrate any beard hairs just slightly further south, I would deal with having like a hairier stomach in order to have my face be more passing. Yep. Because I can get my uh, my stomach waxed. I have very sensitive skin and cannot get my face waxed because I'm a mm. little beach. Tiny beach. Little little bitch. Little fucking can't even can't even get your fucking face waxed. What's even the point? People have tiny tiny. You even have like peach fuzz on your hair. Would they be like really really tiny tiny snakes? Really, really, I kind of like tiny, tiny that. Tiny snakes? Yes. Oh, yes, I they would love all be. That. Every single individual hair that you have. Actually, I'd say like I'd every be covered like, in snakes. 100 hairs. My eyelashes would be snakes. My eyebrows would be snakes. I am oh. just a big snake. I snake am... Could you imagine how weird it would feel to blink with live snakes oh. as your eyelashes? Because I... they would oh. kind of thump into the bottom of your face and then come back they up. They do that anyway with eyelashes. I don't know eyelashes do that already. How fucking long are your eyelashes? <laughs> wait, wait. When your eyelashes... Are your eyelashes hitting your chin when you blink? <laughs> They'd flop down. To be honest, like it would be hard to keep my eyes open. They hit the cheeks. They hit... I can't. I can't feel my eyelashes on my cheeks, and I have nice eyelashes. Yeah, I've never felt my eyelashes on my cheeks. Yeah, no. 
sure. People couldn't wear sunglasses. Uh, people couldn't wear sunglasses or just regular glasses. Yeah, no, I, I have had the um, issues of like when I am wearing glasses, it's like the eyelashes are like pressed up against, and it's like, oh. Uh. Ew. I've never had that problem in my life. Also, I love that I forgot about the existence of regular glasses in my rage. You're like went sunglasses. Straight to sunglasses. That's, well, I think that's just because you're a cool person. Yeah, exactly. Like, forget the fact that I actually wear glasses. <laughs> what are those? Um, that takes away from you being a cool person. 40-40. 40-40. 40-40. I think Roger, Roger. I need... I need... I, if the snakes could give me like snake eyes and snake ears, I'd definitely take that because I need replacement. You can um, no, but you can you can train the snakes to like yeah. point out danger to you and fight. If you're in a fist fight, wait, yeah. you have hair in your ears as well. Stop. You've got little snakes coming out your ears. Stop. Nose hairs. They uh. whisper secrets to you. A little snake in your ear. I when I say all of your hair, I mean all of your hair. Yeah, you'd I'm just cheese be covered. Boy. You'd covered in snakes, but I kind of like. I'd well, rather yeah. like that than cheese because I don't like cheese yeah, 100%. anyway. No, I am lactose intolerant. I only eat cheese on pizza. <laughs> God, a lactose intolerant you. person that sweats cheese is just <laughs> cursed. Um, I because that's that's the worst curse you could ever get from yeah. like a Roman or Greek yeah. god. Yeah. I'd rather have the snakes, because then I can, like, ha- have a little pets as well. And I'm not, yeah, and people wouldn't All come near me. All over your body. You I'd just be like, Karen, do you want to get bit? Fuck off. i, I got to be real with you, though. You would not be able to hold down a job. At a snake farm, maybe. You w- mm. No, because the snakes aren't independent from you. Like... They grow out of your body, yes, yeah. but they are attached. No, but I like, would, you I can sell I them could, off as pets. No, but I can, like, be at a zoo. Yeah, Looking I would, I would join. What you're like saying a... is you'd be in the freak show. No, so that's no, what I was no, gonna no, say. I was, no, I'd join no, no, the no, traveling no. circus. I don't. That's I'm your only that. career option. I'm fine with that. That's literally the only employment. And if then you I get just to sit like, there, yeah, people will love me. That I'm done with. Yeah, that. no. And then, but no, no, no. Think... But then you'd have a moment where you go. Uh, where you'd I sing. am beautiful. Yeah, no, that's no. What's what's the song? I was gonna start singing it. It was gonna be funny, and then I can. I think I've blocked out Sharp. my memory because I Sharp. hate it. You're so not much. allowed to. There's a, there's um a lot of songs. What is it? What is the thing? From... Uh, is it "Stupid Horse" by One Hundred Gex? Yeah. When it's the like, uh, fell shut down up! Down shut up! Down. I'm gonna punch you in the fucking head if you say that again. Um, yeah. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad it had that reaction. Some somebody somebody had their hard drugs for breakfast this morning okay no. seraphina since when did you start taking illegal protein supplements <laughs> no it's just i that. drink g-force <laughs> seraphina's on steroids no it's it's that song they played it at work so much and oh. i did like that movie but now i'm like i i i oh you shouldn't have liked that can, movie but i carry cannot on. stand that specific song anymore Oh so, yeah, it's awful. Um, I have no idea what you. It's two the are Greatest about. Showman, the film. I've with, never seen or heard with anything Jackman from Hugh it. in it and Efron the Zack. Ah. <laughs> Jackman Hugh. <laughs> Jackman Hugh and Efron the Zack and. Oh, Hugh Jackman. And, okay. And Zen and then Day is Zen. Day is Zen. Why do you have um, to do this, Serafina? Why can't you just keep it to text? Why do you have to speak like this as well? I don't know. Mm. I it's my pa- disturbing. It's uh yeah, but um uh, I I, Not I a don't fan. I don't want to I I don't want to be have a song where it's like I'm valid and I'm beautiful. Like no, you're covering snakes. Like, that's <laughs> uh, so wait. That can't be valid or beautiful. <laughs> no. Oh, it's probably very attractive to like somebody with a snake and woman fetish. Exactly. Imagine getting kissed by loads of little snakes. <laughs> I am <laughs> only <laughs> at all ever be interested in someone if their body is covered in snakes constantly yeah same it's a curse win-win my curse is that i sweat cheese i would genuinely hate being around you Mm. i mean if you you sweat cheese but what kind kind of of cheese cheese as well is it feta oh oh, yeah yeah. we into that do i get to choose the cheese no i like the idea of it just being like the most mild cheddar Oh no! Because no. I, I mean, mozzarella would be amazing. Because then it could like stringy. It would it yeah. would string off of you though. That's disgusting. Oh, and also like, but, like it's, it's not best. a positive thing. It's not going to be good quality cheese. Why not? Because then it's not a curse. 
but I then think, it's a money-making scheme. Wait, no, I think the curse is already enough that, like, I sweat cheese. I think that yeah, I, but I think I'm I allowed can make to have money be off by cheese. being a snake woman. So exactly. Oh no, you would get beaten to death in the streets and then paraded around like the Natural <laughs> Science Museum, wouldn't you? Let's be honest. Yeah, but I'd be remembered. Let's be honest. I would be remembered. No, you wouldn't, because they wouldn't have your name. They'd just be Snake no, Woman. No, Sna- Discovered Snake in Snake England. Athena. They wouldn't call you that. Snake They'd Athena. They wouldn't She's call you that specifically because I wouldn't let them <laughs> what? call what? you that. Why? I'd be like, hey, I found this weird <laughs> snake woman. Oh. Ashley. Don't know who she is. Who lives, a, who dies, who tells I can be story. a superhero and I'm like, snake Athena. No, I'm sorry. If you're covered in snakes, you're a villain. All right. Um, can I be a hero if I'm if I swear cheese you? boy? Oh my god, you're you're both the uh, opposites. You know, like you were both oh involved god. in the same radiation yeah. accident, but Seraphina was handling a snake, and you were eating cheddars, surrounded eating by cheese. cheese and really sweaty at the time. <laughs> yeah, I had like a I had a spread. It's the Shark Boy and Lava Girl for 2020. Oh my god, cheese, cheese boy and cheese cheese boy snake, snake Athena. No, it'd be like cheese lad and snake class. No. Snake secretion. No. You're not. No. Cheese they're, 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 secretion. In Shark Boy and Lava Go- Girl, they're not called like Lava. Hannah and Joe, and it's Sharko and <laughs> fucking yeah, Lava but, yeah, Anna. But I've like, got a It's Shark Boy and Lava no. Girl. Cheese Because you don't have a real name when you become a superhero. Cheese Marin and Snake Athena. <laughs> Jeez, I fight no. for the Gouda of humanity. Listen, <laughs> as you both are aware, all intellectual property that comes out of this podcast is my property. Cheeseman. Wait. Can I call you myself? Signed the contract. Cheeseman. Um, I'm going to say it again. Cheeseman. 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 Jones. Cheeseman and Snake Athena. Gonna fight crime. Cheeseman. 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 Snake Athena. Snake Athena. <laughs> Athena. Bang, bang, bong. Why? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. We punch crime. <laughs> I punch bite crime. crime with my snakes. I put cheese on the floor sometimes. <laughs> and... <laughs> I Wait, repulse the only enemy. when it's particularly warm. Wait, you can make like cheese nets. Like, here's my. Oh yeah, it's like a really mozzarella. shitty spider, My mozzarella yeah. net. <laughs> I try to swing from oh. my webs, but they they break. You can decide uh, what type of cheese it is, <gasps> and also the mozzarella webs that you try to swing from they would yeah. just keep stretching so you jump off the building and you just keep going <laughs> it's like damn ah! that cheese pull <gasps> what about cheese what about those cheese strings and you just keep you you, you shoot them out of your hand <laughs> they're pellets I shoot they're out. cheese no, pellets like, it's it's no. not like high speed also it's, my, it's the yeah, same my paws, speed as sweat my paws no, but he's, have to be he's massive. been like he's been like um keeping his sweat cheese in his cheese That's gun. Disgusting. Cheese gun. Honestly, that is the most disgusting thing you've ever seen. <laughs> stop was... talking. Stop trying to make Here's this like Here's cool because you can't. So, if you have you ever, have you guys ever like had or like talked about um, like blue cheeses and stinking bishops? Because people say, ah, a sweaty cheese. The cheese is sweating. Ew. What if what if I sweat the cheese? That's like, you know. And the cheese is also sweating. Exactly. Producing tiny Camerons. It, yeah, the cheese sweats me. I sweat the cheese. Symbiotic relationship, ontologically parasitic, amazing. <sighs> Love it. Love it. Thank you, science, for providing us with bullshit words <laughs> to keep saying when we're talking about sweating cheese into tiny yeah. people. Yeah, yeah. We can try and elevate it, but really. Yeah. Hey, hey, guys, guys. Mm-hmm. So I am of an old age. Oh, of of twenty four years. All right, perhaps. all right, grandma. All right, grandma. Grandma. All right, and, grandma. Um, Gonk. Do you know what I just discovered about a week ago? The bingo hall. No, <laughs> even better, grandma. So, grandma. You know how I have like a love, a bad back relationship <laughs> with um, all octopi. Okay, yeah, that is true. I I was sat down on my phone. I was like, I don't know what to do with myself. I would love to see an octopus right now. Guess what I learned you can do? You can just type octopus into YouTube and it comes with octopus videos. I had no idea you could do that. We're living in the future. Here's the thing. It seems so obvious once you've done it. But before you've done it for the first time, 
you don't realize the possibilities of the tiny brick that you keep in your pocket can show you the most amazing videos of octopi can show me videos of octopi I, doing I... very cool things such as stealing from fishermen <gasps> little rascals little thieves good um, so power power to the octopi question, what is your most recent youtube search oh, oh no, no. <laughs> what is my most recent youtube um... search oh it's gonna be oh dear oh actually <laughs> mine's quite funny Mine is. Uh, mine is. Mine is. Cops shouldn't have guns. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we agree. I agree. <laughs> um, Fun. Mine. <laughs> mine's really boring. Mine's is pastel goth makeup tutorial. <laughs> <laughs> that's really funny. Uh, you outage. wish you were a pastel goth. Mm, wow, that's. You, you wish you were a pastel goth. You're just a regular goth. Yeah. You're no. like goth light. No, I'm not even a goth. Your game I'm not up. even a goth, really. You're like you're you're weeaboo goth vibes, you know. It's true. It's true. It's you're you're what a goth would be if they were put into an anime. What? And that's not that's not a compliment. Oh. <laughs> you fucking Wait, weeb. Wait, anime goth. I'm gonna Google this. You're just gonna get so much tea. It's just gonna it's gonna it's gonna bring up a mirror. It's they don't look anything like me. Shut the fuck up. They just they they all look they all look pastel goth or too edgy goth. I'm not none of these fuckers. I ain't also, none commit of these. to your style, bro. Sarah Kina, you're too your own blazy. <laughs> no, I have had a, like a thing is about fashion. Like I feel like everyone wants to be like want to fit in a box, and I'm like. Yeah. Just because, like, I have blue hair and I have piercings and, um, yeah, I'm a goth. See, I thought I was doing that. I was like, oh, I'm really individual. I don't dress like anyone else. And then TikTok came about and I saw all these skinny white boys doing exactly <laughs> what I was doing. And I was like, oh, cool. Turns out you're the exact, um, like, cookie cutter um, skinny white boy. Yeah, I just it's. Mm. I guess it was like inevitable. Mm. Aww, Cameron. I just look like I should have worked on a horse ranch. You really should have. You do, yeah. How do you yeah. feel no. about except horses. for the fact I hate horses? Yeah, I was no, gonna and say. you also don't. You and you. I think. I think you. You. you you're too colourful for a horse ranch. I think they're quite. Well, modern. howdy, folks. Welcome to Melgan Horse Ranch. I feel like you could be like. Can a, I take your order? I feel like you could be a, an unproblematic um, Joe Exotic. Shut up. I'm good, thank you. Shut up. I I am so good, not having that. In fact, yeah. that fuck you. Yeah, fuck you, Cameron. <laughs> and whatever vehicle you rode to this podcast on. Oh, speaking of vehicle. Um, censored. Not doing so good. Also censored. Car. Uh, okay, I really thought you were talking about like a coworker of us for a second. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wow, now no. is not the time, Cameron. Oof. No, I. <laughs> I would not bring that up. He's <laughs> <laughs> dead. He's dead. How would you say that, Cameron? We were in the middle of recording. I have time oh to God. process. My favourite part of this is that I have to censor every time we say the word Fucking hell, okay guys, are you being serious right now? Yeah, because you wouldn't you, you wouldn't have to if you didn't think I was talking about the co-worker because the name of my car is like, fine, who cares? Oh no, I'm gonna censor your car as well. I know, <laughs> but now I have to censor my car name because then people will just know. Anyway, so my car, um, yeah, steering went on it, couldn't steer it very well. Um, now, now I've got to pay quite a bit of money to uh, keep him working, and good thing I love him. Mugs game, mate. Mugs game. Mugs game. This is why I don't drive. Yeah, you you will you will never make money Unforeseen driving a car. Unforeseen expenses. It's just here's the thing, right? So everybody, all the real adults who are like have real jobs and stuff, like you need to budget and save. And I'm sat here like, yeah, but like unforeseen expenses. I'm. I mean, to be honest, I did. I have saved up money for this thing i like as in i have money for unforeseen expenses saved away so i hate I'm good. you <laughs> i do not i literally have whatever is in my only bank account mm. and if tomorrow that were emptied by the government 
I would be fucked. Hum. Mm. Hum. This is like, why you have. I think there's maybe three. like you... a fiver in loose change lying Sarah. around my house. Mm-hmm. Sarah, can we can we get Ashley an accountant? Yes, I'm an accountant. Um, now I'm a, I'm an account all your money. <laughs> I'm an account your money. <laughs> <laughs> One, two. Three, four, five. Why did you become vaguely like Norse there? I don't a know. Like, hello, I am Gluten, the accountant. <laughs> I'm gonna count your money, and um, you know no, that was Italian. Europeans. No, no, count money. That's Italian. That's an no, Italian no, accent. No, no, doing, no, right? no, 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 no. That's, that's ah, the that, Italians. That's European. Very good with money. My name is Gluten. Yeah, what you're doing is like, I am Italian. Stallion. No, it's like oh, yeah. a Swedish. It's like a Swedish one. We stopped it's talking like, about no. macaroni. This this girl, this guy, is a, ah. they make a, a yeah, you know. I'm the Italian, Catholic. the most beautiful of the languages, fettuccine Alfredo. Linguine. I don't know what goddamn language you're speaking, but in my country we speak American. <laughs> I really thought you were gonna do the army chant, then you know the. I don't know what I've been told. I don't I think it's actually a law that if anybody says, I don't know what I've been told, you have to repeat it. Oh. My legs are long and I am old. My legs, Your are, legs long are long and, and I you am are old. old. You are old. We've already established that yeah. Ashley's yeah. Like, I, I thought you meant like about to die. But... Sound off! <laughs> <laughs> what did you even scream then? Sound off. It got cut out by Discord. I'm going to be cutting that. Do not worry. She was lying. She didn't cut anything. I'm looking at... So, I'm looking at my Audacity file right now. And it's just blue all the way down, baby. (laughs) It's just blue all the way down, baby. Are we okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all good. No, I mean, when I screamed... I see. My waveform became just a square. (laughs) 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 Which, um... Is not good audio content. I can't wait till I'm listening back to this and that shits me up. It real did shit her up. Shit me anyway. up, baby. Sh- I think the best accent is Swedish. I'm just gonna like, I love the shabby, the clan. The okay, I, I, I can get down to that. Yeah, and then, um, yeah. yeah. It's like, I don't think you need to do the accent. I mean, I, I think you saying the Swedish accent is beautiful. For, I can get behind that. For, but then as soon as you start doing the Swedish accent, that's when I start to get put off. The, the, this isn't even a Swedish accent. You are aware of no, that, No, I know right? it is. I've seen Swedish No, before. 100%. <laughs> I'm the like, one. Oh, I love the Cameron... Swedish accent. It's so beautiful. <laughs> it's so like, oh my God, mate. We fucking love a little bit of Swedish accent. We love accent, a bit of Swedish don't accent, we? yeah. Listen... I'm not here to fuck spiders, mate, but let me tell you, that Swedish <laughs> I, accent that I'm currently oh, doing. I, love I can't believe Swiss that that's a real thing. That's not an accent. No, oh, I love when... Swiss cheese. Going down pub. Going down cheese. Going down... Stop. S- Serafina, you are going off on one. Sorry. There is, there is an event that is happening, and I'm going to live commentary on this event. Oh. I made a very loud noise, and I've summoned the neighbor's cats. <gasps> oh. They are just meowing <gasps> outside of the window right now. <laughs> oh, and I'm staring them down. Is this wow. That, One that... of them is doing that weird so... thing that, where he just lies on his back and spreads his legs at me. Okay, well, so so going back. No, um... no, I want to hear about the cats. No, 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 no. This is relevant no, to the cats. No, this oh. is relevant to the cats. We have Cheese Boy um, or Cheeseman, uh, Snake Athena, and Cat Girl. <laughs> No, I just because uh, that's a licensed me- uh, property. Okay. I'm um, the cat yellow. Cat no, you're yell. you're, you're, you're pussy caller. Yell the cat. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm I'm the pussy caller. Pussy caller. <laughs> the pussy summoner. <laughs> Unfortunately, um, that does get me a lot of incorrect bookings. Yeah, I mean, you still go um, along though and get your like money. sometimes I show up and I'm like, okay, where's the pussy I'm summoning? And it's just like a bunch of like 50 year old men who are really sweaty and they live in their parents' basement Mm. and they're all just staring at me like, (laughs) you know, like that's the only noise they make the entire time. And um, it's not great. It's not great. Um, You know, so if you'd consider donating to our Patreon (laughs) so I no longer have to summon pussy for a living anymore. Oh, Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, Um, I made that announcement last time, but obviously it got um cutted didn't it 
cut it. So it didn't get cut. It just got destroyed. It deleted, got deleted, in decimated. fact, some might say. You got cucked by, by Cap. Yeah. You got you cut Patreon the last get cucked. Seraphine, I'm going to need you to, like, stop. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay um stop stop telling us that we've been cucked by our own podcast i think I've we have been cucking um, holding you all uh do you want to say our cucking patreon holding. link ashley that is patreon.com slash big tin media that's b-i-g-t-i-n-m-e-d-i-a once again, that's patreon.com slash big tin media, uh, where you'll get exclusive blooper reels, access to the legendary secret first ever episode that will never make it onto the main feed, mm-hmm. and also some background bullshit okay. when I can be bothered to just make wank. Sorry, just just to just cut in quick. Um, you said uh, uh, patreon.com slash big tin media. Was that a forward slash or a backslash? Just, just so I know patreon.com <laughs> forward slash big tin media uh, that's p-a-t-r-e-o-n dot c-o-m forward slash b-i-g-t-i-n-m-e-d-i-a that's patreon.com forward slash people aren't listening big anymore. tin media people have stopped listening <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh. thank you for listening to this week's episode play the music Hello everyone, Ashley here. Thank you so much for listening to this episode of Blank Book. If you enjoyed the episode, consider supporting us on Patreon at patreon.com slash big tin media. That's patreon.com forward slash B-I-G-T-I-N-M-E-D-I-A. There you will find exclusive bonus content for our supporters, including blooper reels and special episodes. If you can't make a monetary pledge, you can also support us by sharing the podcast with your friends. Blank Block is a Big Tin Media production, starring hosts Ashley Maligan, Cameron Bloomer, and Serafina Buick. For updates about the show and other projects that we have in the works, follow our Twitter, at Big Tin Media. For more from Cameron, follow him on Twitter, at The Lumpy Boy, or on Instagram, at Cameron Bloomer, spelled B-L-U-M-E-R. For more from Serafina, follow her on Twitter, at Sacred Cows Media, or on Instagram, at Sacred Cows. And for more from me, Ashley, follow me on Twitter at Trashley M. That's T R A S H L E I G H M. Stay valid, stay sexy, and stay safe. See you next week.